check on the laptop, check on the mobile, check on the classical music. Hello everyone, this is James Nussbaumer and I am of jamesnussbaumer.com. I am the author of this book, The Master of Everything, a story of mankind in the world of illusion we call life. On sale everywhere books are sold and Amazon has it rated a four and a half star which I'm extremely proud of. But tonight's video blog is about what do you want to achieve in life? What is it that you really want? Are thoughts of anxiety, fear, and lack getting in your way? Your ego-based mind will use up your valuable time here on earth to convince you that you are always lacking something. And the excuses will pour in as to why you cannot afford to take action on something that you feel that you truly want in life. There's always an excuse, and it's always reasons for lack. I don't have enough of this, enough of that. Um, the ego does its best job to keep you from going after your true free will. There's not enough money or not enough something else, like I had just mentioned. That will always be the ego's battle cry, time and time again. Is this the way you honestly really want to think for the rest of your life? A year from now, you will wish you had started today to accept the divine nature that you truly are, the self that has been trying to touch you about your true free will. The ego uses time as a tool to shift your perception wrong-mindedly into scarcity thinking and will avoid truth to surface at all cost. For me, now in my late 50s, I see this as a great example in understanding my own healing process. Spurts of growth, but where things only seemed fearful, but that which I faced and pursued regardless of fear trying to be my ruler. I also learned that things can't be rushed or they cannot be forced, but action does need to be taken to overcome these fears. Look at it this way where fear is concerned. One of the most sensitive aspects about accepting that you have been having a false love affair with fear is that human nature has the potential to make fear into something that it's, that it, and something that it's not. Thereby we mistrust ourselves. But by operating through your true free will, you extend that unto others and therefore help them see where they need to be as well. You then rid yourself of those darkened thoughts of always being stressed out over time and lack. A Course in Miracles states, the journey that we undertake together is the exchange of dark for light, of ignorance for understanding. Thereby, nothing you understand is ever fearful. And our true understanding of what we are here to do in this world proves to us that time is used within the universal law of cause and effect to bring us together with certain individuals at the right time. For instance, think about that so-called chance encounter in a coffee shop or what have you. You know, th those kind of things often change things. For example, when I first met my good friend Ron on the driving range at a golf course down in sunny Florida back in 1986, Lord only knew where that meeting would lead us. He was there to be, by my, to be my support system when I began a 10-year prison term in 2007 for a foolish securities violation. His constant effort since my sentencing date seeking out lawyers came through and he finally sought the right attorney finally found the right lawyer who understood my dilemma and the lawyer was able to have me released but after it took eight long years but I was released two years early from that ten-year terrible ordeal I mean that when we put our truthful self out there with a conscious decision to move forward to our dreams miracles begin showing up people show up in our lives and whether it's for business or personal reasons you will always be encountering the right people for that moment so relax and don't let thoughts of lack or time threaten you let life happen while you do your part to live your true free will which is truly leading a responsible life hey everyone the master of everything I hope you will pick it up 
Uh, it's on Amazon.com. It's published by Ozark Mountain Publishing Company. On sale wherever books are sold. My second book is being released soon, the sequel to this book. In the description box of this YouTube video, you'll see my website, jamesnussbomber.com. And it ta if you click on it, it will take you to my Real Abundance page that has some links you can, ch uh, you can click on uh, with a video or two that you can watch that can lead you to some opportunities that you may have been searching for to no avail. Good evening, everyone, and I hope you have a tremendous night ahead and a great future. Thank you for listening. Till the next.